Many people ask, should you eat snow? Is it safe to eat snow? Is snow clean? What about drinking snow? Can you drink snow melt? Let's have a look at some of those issues. Snow is primarily made out of water, and like any water source found in nature, it has the potential to be clean, healthy, and safe to drink, or it might be full of contaminants and should be filtered before consuming or avoided altogether. The safety and cleanliness of the snow you eat will depend largely on where you live. If you live in or near an industrial area or a big city that pumps lots of toxins into the air, then the snow that falls to the ground will no doubt be full of all kinds of nasty stuff that you most likely would not want in your body. Snowfall in suburban areas will be a little less polluted but may still have significant levels of contaminants. The snow that falls to the ground in areas of pristine wilderness will obviously be much healthier. But even in those areas, the air is not always as pure and clean as you may think. Scientists have found pesticides in the air that was 30, 40, and even 50 years old in high elevation areas of places such as Alaska's Denali Park and the Olympic Peninsula of Washington State. However, and very importantly, the levels were a hundred times lower than what's deemed safe for drinking water. This is generally the case with snow in most urban areas as well. That is, while you still may want to avoid it, the level of contaminants in freshly fallen snow is well below the level of being truly toxic when consumed in small amounts. As snow falls through the sky, the net-like structure of billions of snowflakes catches the pollutants in the air and scrubs the atmosphere clean. Thus, as health experts suggest, it's best to wait till the snow has fallen for a few hours before you consume it, as the longer the snow falls, the lower the pollution levels will be. So again, wait an hour or two before harvesting your snow and only eat it in very small amounts and make it a point to only get fresh, untouched snow from the cleanest environments possible. Obviously, don't eat any yellow snow, don't eat snow that's been walked on, shoveled, or plowed, or that's even near any shoveled, plowed, or high traffic areas. Also, avoid eating snow during windy days, as strong winds can mix all kinds of extra dirt and pollutants in with the snow. And finally, as with eating or drinking anything from nature, or even from your favorite restaurant for that matter, keep in mind that you ultimately do so at your own risk. If you'd like to see more videos like this one, be sure to subscribe to this channel and check out the 3 Minutes Outdoors website at 3minutesoutdoors.com. And finally, if you'd like to support this channel, click on the link in the video description below to find out more.